Today on the Stay at Home Chef, I am showing you how to make cream cheese chicken sliders. This recipe is a delicious and easy dinner option that's perfect for a busy weeknight or a casual gathering. One that my family loves and I love that dinner can be cooking away during the day. Let's jump right into this recipe and get our chicken into the slow cooker. A tip I like to share is to always give your slow cooker a little bit of a cooking oil so it's easier to clean. For the chicken, I'm using four trimmed large chicken breast. Go ahead and place them in there. Season up the chicken breast with a teaspoon of black pepper and one teaspoon of salt. To the chicken, we're gonna add in one cup of pineapple rings with the juice. And trust me on this one, it adds a sweet and tangy dimension to this chicken. Then we're gonna add in four tablespoons of sliced salted butter right on top of those pineapple rings. Chicken breasts are such a lean meat, that added fat is gonna help keep that moist texture, but if you don't wanna add it, I won't judge you. And then we need to add barbecue sauce, which I'm gonna whip up my own homemade sauce, but you could definitely use a store-bought sauce to make it easy. To make our homemade barbecue sauce, we're gonna start with one cup of ketchup in a bowl and add to that a fourth a cup of brown sugar, one fourth a cup of Worcestershire sauce, two teaspoons of liquid smoke, two teaspoons of salt, and two teaspoons of black pepper, two teaspoons of garlic powder, and a half a teaspoon of red pepper flakes, and a half a teaspoon of ground mustard. Add that into that and give that a stir until it's well combined. There you've got a delicious homemade barbecue sauce. Use about half of that barbecue sauce and pour that over the chicken. You can cook this on high for four to five hours or on low for six to eight hours. Magically, it is cooked and it smells incredible. You can see it is swimming in juices and what we're gonna do is remove those pineapple rings and remove all but one cup of the juices. You're gonna add in eight ounces of cubed up cream cheese to that and the remaining barbecue sauce. Then shred the chicken and mix the sauces and the cream cheese all together. To serve, place the chicken mixture on a toasted dinner roll, add a slice of cheddar cheese, and take that pineapple ring and place it on top. And there you have it, your delicious cream cheese chicken sliders are ready to be enjoyed. Thanks for watching. You can find the full written recipe in the video description below. Be sure to check out thestayathomechef.com where you can find hundreds of restaurant quality recipes you can easily make at home. We'll see you later.